Welcome back. It's time to get cooking this week, and right now we're joined by registered dietitian Tiffany Lean from La Crosse County Health Department. Thank you for joining us today. First things first. Today we're talking about uh, sugar snap peas. It's actually this month's harvest of the month, and also part of the farm to school program. So what does that mean? Some people hear the term farm to school and harvest of the month. So all 19 of our participating farm to school sites will feature sugar snap peas this month on their lunch menu. And most of them are featuring them on a salad bar or garden bar because all of our public elementary schools now have garden bars. That's really cool. And before we actually came back on camera, we kind of talked about the different varieties you have of peas, which is actually probably kind of important for you <laughs> to know if you're going to go out shopping for some sugar snap peas. So we were playing a little earlier at can you name those different varieties of <laughs> peas that we see here. So sugar snap peas are right here that we can see in the middle and they're actually a cross between over here snow peas and then on this side which are our garden peas and those are what you typically find in the grocery store. So if you're shopping in your frozen foods department you'll find a bag of the garden peas but our snow peas and sugar snap peas are actually edible. The entire pod is edible whereas garden peas you find them shelled in the grocery store because you don't eat the pod. So that's important to know if you're at the farmer's market and you pick up either of these two varieties, go ahead and eat the whole pot. You don't have to shell them. Fantastic. So if we are bringing these home, how can we make sure we store them as long as possible? So peas, we usually store them in a plastic bag in the crisper drawer of the refrigerator, and they'll keep for about five to seven days. Of course, the sooner you eat them, the better they're going to taste. And last but not least, we do have a recipe to share for uh, this month. Uh, what is it? So this month's recipe, we have a sautéed sugar snap pea recipe. So it's sugar snap peas sautéed in olive oil and a little bit of salt and pepper. And I did bring on this side, this is just a nice assortment of veggies. And oh, it's okay. a great after school snack for kiddos. We also have a hummus recipe on our website. Okay. So we've got hummus and a nice assortment of veggies. Fantastic. You can go to getactivelacrosse.org for more info on all yeah. of that. Thank you for joining us this week, Tiffany. Mm -hmm. We'll be right back to wrap things up. Don't go anywhere.